reefs are the largest structures built on Earth and are formed by the corals themselves. They are the most diverse ecosystems in our oceans and provide homes for countless animals, including commercial fish species. Many people's lives depend on healthy coral reefs. Corals are tiny animals that live together in colonies of thousands of individuals. Like all animals, corals need to grow and reproduce. When conditions are poor, corals stop their reproduction. Some of them may still spawn, but cannot produce offspring. Around the globe, coral reefs are on the decline because of human impacts such as pollution, overfishing, and climate change. Coral reefs need our help to recover and flourish again. Seacore International is working to help sustain coral reefs. Most coral species spawn only once a year around full moon. In mass spawning events, coral colonies simultaneously release eggs and sperm. These gametes drift to the water surface where they might fertilize. During night dives, our team collects the coral gametes with special nets and immediately brings them ashore. We fertilize the gametes in the laboratory and culture the resulting larvae. After a few days, these free-swimming larvae choose a place to settle and metamorphose into a new coral. The tiny corals require the right conditions to grow and survive. At present, each young coral is still transplanted by hand to restore a coral reef. This is time-consuming, expensive, and limited in scale. We need new approaches to restore reefs at a more meaningful scale. Seacor has developed settlement substrates for coral larvae that self-attach to the reef. They can be produced en masse at low cost. By working with coral's sexual reproduction, we are able to culture millions of larvae with low-tech approaches. Seacor is currently conducting pilot projects for large-scale restoration. One day, we may be able to sow corals onto the reef in huge numbers, aiming at restoring what is currently being lost. give coral reefs a future. Support Seacore International. In 2015, our first raised corals spawned together with the wild corals on the reef.